Now, it seems hard to believe, but this, this material that retrovirologists, including Montaigne and Gallo, were isolating from their cultures, labeling pure HIV, and producing by the thousands of gallons in order to make proteins for the HIV antibody test and for other research purposes, was never examined under an electron microscope in order to determine that this material contained pure retroviral particles. Now, I say it was never examined under a microscope. I assume that some scientists must have examined it under an electron microscope, but no photographs of this examination were ever published in the scientific literature. You know, one can only guess why they weren't.